If you go into the culture files in Crusader Kings 2, you can edit some of the stuff and the ruler designer so you can play as the horse lords. Welcome to the land of horse culture. We live in the nomadic realm of placewherethehorsesare.com. Uh, you can see the kernings a bit screwed up for the... yeah. Uh, anyway, today I'm playing as Hagen Snowmane of the Incatatus Dynasty. So, let's see what we can do as the Horse Lords. Roaming the Eurasian Steppe, look at them, it's the Horse Lords. So, apparently, Paradox didn't add any dynasty names for the horse culture, so all of the clans in my realm have just defaulted to being the Smith clan. As a nomad, I get to pick a war horse, which is a bit weird. As I mount him, I feel like I've made the right choice. Um, so I can call him Stud, Randy, Woody, or Roger. Huh, but apparently I get a fertility bonus from this. That's cool. I will invade you for some more land. My army of horses will just sweep across them. Oh man, these guys stand no chance. Sweet. Oh good, this young human wants to adopt horse culture. My son also looks like a human because I don't think they added child horse photos in the game. Cool, so we've won this war. Now it's time to pillage the human settlements. It's the hu genocide horse lords. So it seems that one of the Smith clans has got a bit upset with me. Fortunately, these Smith clans don't really have much going for them. Do you know how many Smiths I have lined up to replace you? <laughs> A lot. Oh. <laughs> oh, he retired to the glue factory. That makes sense, I suppose. So now is probably the best time to subjugate the Byzantine Empire. Man, this is my best idea I've ever had. Oh god, this was a terrible idea, why did I do it? Nah, I'm just kidding, I'm great at this game. Emperor of the Romans, it's the Horse Lords. And now I'll just kill a bunch more humans. Um, my ward can't ride a horse properly. Um, oh, wow, they, they we become lovers. Yeah, that, that's, that's probably taking it a bit far. Well, he grew up to be a lunatic anyway. Parenting, right? Anyway, we've finished depopulating the Roman lands of people. Time to start global conquests. Ah, oh, I lightly twisted my ankle on my way to the conquest. Apparently walking is mildly annoying now. I'm gonna have to send the kids inside and turn on the tractor's engine. Um, and lead myself out behind the barn. <laughs> Shit. It looks like I've died from, actually we sent him to a nice farm upstate. No really, he's very happy. So now my crazy son in Katardis has taken over. Hopefully he's not gonna screw everything up for us. Oh, what? My human? Oh shit, I've appointed my human as my chancellor. Why would you appoint Twinklefoot as your chancellor? He's a human. Fuck this guy sucks. Twinklefoot is my chancellor. Horse lords. So, the whole point of this playthrough was to try and make horse culture dominant. Wait, what's this culture? Oh, it looks like one of the Smith clans has been replaced by the internal combustion engine. Duh, that's never gonna catch on. Horse lords, they're going conquering. It's the Romans, they've, they've killed, killed them all. Twinkle foot, so, yeah, I mean, they got internal combustion engine. 